just tap on the keyboard button and then automatically we see that our keypad pops up at whatever i do take note that as you are typing it keeps on showing on the pc so everything you type shows on the pc fast so let's say i want to type i play football very well so you see i play football very well as simple as that <laughs>
we go to take another very important step on our mobile app. So you tap on the menu button, that's the three bars over there. Then you go, you see that there is service under the remote there is service. You click on service. This pop up appears on the service page. You're going to create a new server that will allow you to connect your app to that the software on your PC. Okay, so you have to collect your for you to connect your app from your software to your PC, make sure that your hotspot is connected. Over here, I disconnected my hotspot, so I need to connect it back. So it's going to be shown down there that my Wi-Fi has been connected. Okay. So after that, you just click on the plus button. You see a plus near there, that means sign. You see servers, there's a plus and then there's a does mean sign. So we are going to click on those plus to add a new server because it, our server is not automatically showing. So you're going to fill out the details over here. So I'm going to create a name. Let me just create a name, awesome, awesomeness. Let me make it awesomeness. Okay, so I'm going to create a name, awesomeness. And then under the host or IP address, I need to enter the LAN code that is shown on my desktop device. Okay, so I need to enter this 192.168.155.201. I need to enter it on my mobile device. I'm going to enter it 192.168.155.201. Wow, five five dot two one one. Make sure it's the same as that on your PC, else this won't work. Okay, we are done. So we just check it, and then our server has been successfully started. At this point, you should be able to do basic controls. For example, you see the first one is basic inputs. There's file manager. There's keyboard. Let's try out the basic inputs. Okay, you won't upgrade for now. Let's just keep this. They asking us to pay, but then we want to use a free version. Okay. So the basic input should allow us to at least control the mouse pointer on our PC. It's teaching us the steps to do that. So just pass your finger over your phone. You will see that the mouse on your PC is moving. Yes, so that is another feature of this app. You just be passing your finger. You see over here that the mouse pointer on my PC is moving. Okay, so I'm going to make a demonstration to you on how we're going to type on the PC with our mobile device. So over here, you're going to just tap on the keyboard button and then automatically we see that our keypad pops up okay so now as our keypad has popped up we're going to try typing something and see it appear on our desktop so i'm going to type i am a very happy person so now look on our desktop you see it appear there i am a very happy person you see so i want to continue typing more i work very hard at whatever i did take note that as you are typing it keeps on showing on the pc so everything you type shows on the pc okay so what's wonderful about this is that you see your keypad autocorrect feature is going to help you type faster than you would have done typing on your pc keyboard okay so you can see that my autocorrect feature allows me to type what i want to type very very fast so let's say i want to type I play football very well. So you see, I play football very well. As simple as that. So you can actually type on your PC with your mobile device. Thank you.